Hello, hello again, Life Changers. I want to say it's just an honor and such a pleasure to have you guys on board with me. I appreciate you following. I appreciate all your comments. They have been terrific. And you all have been sharing with me with the word. And I want to say thank you for that. It's just so awesome to hear some of, you know, hear your comments in the comment section concerning the word of God. Oh my God, I just love it. It's just so awesome and it's so edifying, you know, to hear your good news and and prayers are being answered and and God is moving in the miraculous. That's just an awesome thing. And I'm going to do scripture and prayer time. And I'm going to come from the book of James 4 and 10. And it says, humble yourselves in the sight of the Lord, and he shall lift you up. All right. And so what 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 is the psalm that says? He's saying, humble yourself. You know, be be humble enough to acknowledge that you need the Lord in all things, not in some things. But we need him in all things. I don't know about you, but I let the Lord know I got to have you. I must have you in my life. I cannot make this journey on my own because it's too hard. I don't even want to try to make the journey by myself because I, 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 I'm weak. I'm feeble. Okay, and I need the Lord's protection. I need his wisdom. I need his encouragement. I need his direction because it gets really hard sometimes, you know, but when the Lord is on board, he gives us, he gives us that peace. He gives us that joy. He surrounds us with his love and he gives us the fortitude and and he fortifies us to the point that we have the strength to go through and, and love him even the more because we know that he's got our back. You know, we know that we can trust him and we know that he loves us just like that. So, you know what? Stay humble and just keep telling God what you have need of. He wants to hear from you. Let us pray. Most gracious and divine Father, we thank you for the life of your word. We thank you, God, that your people are going to be edified. God, we ask that if it's anything like pride on the inside of us, please remove it in the name of Jesus. And God, we ask Ask, oh God, that every need is going to be met according to your riches and glory. We thank you for prayer. We thank you for what you're doing. In Jesus' name, amen. Bless God.